The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. This is SeeingEagles.com. I'm the voice of the Eagles, Adam Cavalier, alongside Carson Newman Ford and newly minted South Atlantic Conference Player of the Week, Jules Herity. Jules, congratulations uh, on the accolade. A three-goal week for you uh, last week, including the game winner over a nationally ranked Lenore Ryan Club. What's the accolade uh, mean to you here in your first season at Mossy Creek? Uh, it means a lot to me. It's uh, great to get recognized, but it's also great for us as a team to be recognized after being predicted ninth in the conference, and hopefully this is putting us on the map now. Ninth in the conference, but 2-0 and uh, to start off conference play, including victories over some pretty heady competition uh, this weekend. Uh, Lenore Ryan beat them in overtime 3-2. to two. Uh, Break down the golden goal uh, that gave the Eagles the win. Uh, well, we had a chance just before that. Um, Holly got put through, and she was unfortunate just to uh, not take that. And then we got we got in again, and Holly set it off to me, and the ball just dropped perfect for me, and I took it, and it went in, and that was it. We just <laughs> it was a great feeling for the team. Two and zero, oh, uh, and you mentioned being picked ninth. What's that like to be sitting at the top of the table? I know it's early, but two big wins uh, at the same time. Uh, it's great for us, and uh, it's a great boost for the team for all of us. But uh, we're still not where we want to be right now and the way we're playing we're still we believe we can uh, do a lot better and um, not conceding goals and taking more of our chances because our shot compared to what we're scoring still not good enough so we're happy where we are right now but it's got to be better multi-goal game against Newberry on Saturday you put two into the back of the net what stands out to you about per your performance from that contest uh, well I think I stole maybe the second one off Meg <laughs> but I'll take it um, but yeah it was it was. I, I felt like I wasn't doing very much in the first half, so I felt like in the second half I had to do something and prove myself, and I think I did that in the end up, so we got the win. Uh, the goal you're referring to, a nice little header. It looked like the ball was headed in from, yeah. but you had you had to finish it. I had it. to make sure it was going in because uh, Seed was behind me as well, so it was, it was whoever <laughs> was going to steal it off her, but she can have the credit for that one. You talked about loads of shots on goal. Yeah. How have you guys generated that level of pressure uh, against opposing teams this season? Well, I think the girls last season, they, it was the same. They had a lot of chances, but they were unlucky not to win games and take those chances. So we've been spending a lot of time in front of goal, and obviously we still need to spend more time. But that's offensively, I think we're looking pretty good right now. Jules, thanks for the time, and congratulations on the Player of the Week accolade. Thank you very much. That is Carson Newman Ford and South Atlantic Conference Player of the Week, Jules Herdy. I'm the voice of the Eagles, Adam Cavalier, and this is CNEagles.com.